Chose it to win this game, grab the horseshoe, three game winning streak. How is it like to reinstill winning into this team and what are you going to do going forward? Uh, yeah, it's really to me more of a standard of excellence. It's, yeah, you want to win. And some games are harder than others, but it's really about your standard of excellence and living up to that. And that's really what it's about. And I, I told the guys, really, it's been interesting. I've been delving into Aggie history a bunch. And the overwhelming feeling I really have is that UC Davis and UC Davis football, it's a, it's a program. It's a program of excellence. It's not about winning football games. It's about being great and achieving greatness in a variety of fronts. Misty and I went to uh, the Secrets of the Universe in Mandavi the other night, and we have some people that are involved with this particle accelerator and over in Switzerland. And one of the best scientific achievements, really, of the last century to some degree. And to know that Davis is kind of a part of that, and they're like people are here that do those things, and and that magical stuff is what in my opinion, Aggie football is. Now, that there's a lot of strain and struggle with that. But to get our guys to understand that and live that and embrace that is so cool because that's marriage stuff, job stuff, life stuff, football stuff, grade stuff. It doesn't really matter. And I've seen little strides each week, and there were a lot of cool moments that happened this week of guys, and you see that coming together. And so it's fun that it results in a quote-unquote win. Um, they're going to be the first ones to tell you, and I think, I don't know, Miles is probably in here. I mean, he had a pretty dang good day, but I'll guarantee you that fumble is weighing heavy on his mind. And so, and that's okay, and that's cool, and that's what it should be. It should be, hey, yeah, I did this, we've got to work on this. You know, CJ had a good game. He's like, I promise you, Coach, it's never, never going to happen again. So having guys understand that is really cool because it, transcends football and that seems kind of corny but I love that stuff but then having the understanding of what you can accomplish and shoot look at Casey Grantforce you guys haven't heard a whole lot from him he's been banged up comes in two touchdowns uh, J Po gets a touchdown um, so you know Mateo rips one off I mean obviously Teddy coming back but that stuff is just really cool to see everybody involved and everybody maximizing themselves I mean that's as a teacher, as an educator, as a parent, like you live for that. That's what it is. That's the that's the optimal experience. That's what it is. It's got to be gratifying the last three weeks to get so many guys, not not just into the game, but like you say, guys like we didn't. I don't think I've written Grantford in my notebook yet this year. And there's and he's a good player. Yeah, he's a good player. And Mateo takes off like the fastest guy on the field. Yep, um, that is great, and it's because you just again. I'm into contributors, I'm not really into starters, and we're into uh, everybody's role. And a Tim Ornelas who's not in here, Tim Ornelas is the best video guy in the country. If that guy doesn't do what he does, we don't operate. But nobody knows that, nobody sees that. So having all these guys that, uh, here comes Miles, having all these guys that contribute in so many ways, and little ways, and we talk about a thousand invisible moments, and that's what, that's what life is, and that's what championships are, and that's what great organizations are, is that you know, guys are willing to grind it out, even though they're not, the name's not in the headline, they may not start, but to finally see those guys have their moment in the sun is, you know, is really cool. And, and to really have all the other guys going, hey, get so-and-so in, let's do this, let's get him, let's... I mean, that's just, that's just the good stuff. It's the good stuff. I wanted to ask about CJ's big game. Um, you alluded to this earlier, over 100 yards, very few catches, really good game. How is it good? How is it like useful having him create for others on the field as like just like uh, Florio and Yeah, he uh, can do he can do a lot. CJ's a hard runner. He's not the biggest dude, but he's strong, he's powerful, he's explosive. And we have a lot of guys that love football on our team, including Miles and Teddy, but I don't think anybody loves football more than CJ Hutton. Now, some may as the same, but more, I don't know. That guy loves football. Um, he got a huge heart. He's a really talented player. He's a tough dude. Um, and we're, we're lucky to have him. He's a good player. And he's a great, great dude. He's a great competitor. You guys have a coach? Get a mile in here? Yeah. yeah.